There. It was in view. There we go. Well, what did the Pythia tell you? The cult of Cosmos is hunting me. But I'm going to hunt them first. She told me they meet in a secret chamber under the Temple of Apollo. So it's all true. If the cult has done anything, it's fooled this old man. I can't get in without a mask and cloak. It's how the cultists identify each other. The Temple of Apollo is by the cave of Yea. Simple enough to find. But a cultist's mask and cloak? How will you accomplish that? The Pythia gave me the only clue I need. When I'm ready, I'll meet you at the temple. For now, I'm going to kill Elpinor. Malakas liar. Uh, don't you still have to play on Ubisoft even if you buy the game on Steam? Yeah, when, when I go to Steam and I hit play, it like opens an Ubisoft launcher briefly and then that launches the game. Uh, so... I can't get in here without the cloak and mask thing. Alright, what is going on over here? Oh, it's some guy fighting a boar. Alright. Let's see. Hit it with a torch. Wait, what? Bounty hunter nearby. I didn't do anything. Uh, let's see. Let's the honest are. Thank you for the raid. Welcome. Muggle Douglas, but thought it'd be Reginald Esquire the fourth. This is Johnson Vance Novels the third. Welcomes you and your dear viewers to the lab. Hope you enjoy your stay today. It's on the way. Crank at the speakers. Don't touch the speakers. Give a voice every week. Please take a seat, but you'll only need the edge. Mm. Welcome. We are playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey. We're just a few hours in. I'm new to the game, having a lot of fun so far. Mm. Not where you needed to go, but grain silos go boom. Oh my god, so you had me blow up a grain silo and I didn't even need to do that? Unbelievable. You get a cookie. Once again, chat, we can truly appreciate the auto-pathing in this game. Because it lets me do this. Look at that. It's like, it's like getting an in-flight movie as we travel. Yeah, I was, I was about to press E to dismount, and I almost pressed E when that flashing steel button lit up for just a moment. That would have messed me up. I picked up your message on the board. What's happening? My friend, a commander. They say he went mad at the festival and attacked another officer. Sounds like your friend can't hold his wine. He saved my life. He must be freed. I'll bribe the other officer. Or kill him. I won't see one moment of madness ruin a good man. You want me to deliver it? Right. He'll be waiting for it. I'll help you. So deliver a bribe. My word. Or kill the guy. Thank you. I'll try delivering the bribe. Be discreet. And then we'll have I a backup plan. Going. If you try killing and then the bribe's the backup plan, it doesn't work nearly as well. This is my experience as a hitman. I made transcendence today. Congratulations. That's awesome. That's a big project. I bet you feel good finishing that. A legendary amulet for PvP. Can you bribe him if you kill him first? I don't think so. 
<laughs> you just kill him and then throw a wallet onto his corpse. Keep the change, you filthy animal. Important delivery for you. From a politician. Thank you, Mistios. Here, this is for you. He gave me 11 chunks of iron. <laughs> Thanks. What? <laughs> All right. That was an easy side quest. Literal delivery mission. Uh, bounty on a bandit. Let's do this one. Let's see. Come on. Well, that was a long ride. I'm glad we had uh, travel for that. Would have been awful if we had to walk all the way there. Really tried this move much yet. Let's give this a shot. It's not very powerful currently. The poison stick. Bonk. I've seen pops fight better than you. What? Oh my gosh. Confirm kill. Quick, build a house and kick him off the roof. Alright, now I'm imagining the kick ability in Fortnite. Where you just conjure up a five-star hotel with Wi-Fi and then just kick him off. <laughs> Level 10. Greek reflex bow. Uh, let's see. So... Upgrade. All right, let's salvage some of these. All right. All right. You like? Let's go. Okay. Easy quest. Do I need to turn it in, or is it just done? I guess it's just done. Uh, kill the Spartan soldiers. My patience to do side quests is so much longer when the horse takes me to the side quest chat. Like, my pa my patience is just huge. Like, I just, oh my god, just, ugh, raging patience. <laughs> like, ugh. Stop talking about how big your patience is, you show off. No. I appreciate you said that as the horse pinballed around the environment. Yeah, I mean, look, we get there when we get there, okay? New mercenary discovered. Okay. Yeah, that was kind of weird. He's like, all right, I need to go over there, then follow the road, even if it means running over this random person two times. By the way, for those of you who uh, enjoy Riftbreaker, like myself, they actually released some new news uh, last night. 
I did a news video about it today, my second ever Riftbreaker news video, but for those of you who might share an interest in the game with me, I uh, published a video that had everything that we knew about the new content coming out. It was really cool. Um, and then also had a YouTube short and then like uh, a game review went live yesterday that uh, was a big project that uh, Noxie worked on for a few days. Really happy with it. So definitely encourage you guys to check it out if you haven't already seen it. Mercenary hunting and ranking was one of my favorite parts of this game. I mean, it seems like the mercenaries just come to you if you're bad enough. I don't mean bad like banana yelling skill issue. I mean bad like if you're naughty enough, they just show up. This quest seems like it was pretty far out of the way. Hey, question for you guys. Top right corner. There's a 10, which I assume is my level, and underneath it it says plus one bingle bongle. What is the bingle bongle? Ability point. Oh, so it's like an unspent point? Is that what it is? Gotcha. Okay. in plain sight. What? There who is? Okay, I just stumbled upon another quest I wasn't even intending to do right now. Keep. Hold it right there. Wait, 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 it was a prank! <laughs> Poison Steak! Noticing that I can use the poison ability without having, I don't know what to call it, adrenaline? I'm done with this area. Uh, let's see. Did you stop playing PoE or just replace it and streams play offline? Uh, I've kind of stopped for now. I, I, I got my PoE fix for the season, I think. Uh, let's see. Spartan heads. Kill Spartan state leaders all over Greece. Um, what is the quest I'm right next to? Your target is currently one level above you. Uh, let's go to abilities. Let's take a look here. Alright, I, I would prefer the answer to the question I'm about to ask be a vague one. At what point do I get to put, like, additional ability points into one skill, such as leveling kick up to two? Is it like I have to reach a certain level, or is it just like a checkpoint in the story? It's very soon. Okay. Let's see. Beastmaster, hold E to tame an animal. Tame wolves that have been knocked out. Only one wild creature can be tamed at a time. Oh, that sounds neat. If the if a pet dies, do you have to go tame a new one? Or will it, like, respawn? Like, it's got plot armor. Rain down a volley of arrows in an area of three meters, doing 300% hunter damage. Uh, increase hunter damage by 20%. No longer consume normal area arrows when using hunter abilities. You need to tame a new one. 
Does the wolf kind of like teleport with you like your horse does if you fast travel? If I choose to use it? It does, okay. Thoughts on massive maps like an Odyssey? I'm fine with it. As long as like there are some methods of getting around like transportation that aren't too annoying, I'm fine with it. Like we've got the teleport between the um, parts where we um, like climbed on towers and stuff. You got the ships that you can move around. We got the horse, and it has auto pathing. Um, it's enough that I don't I don't mind the massive map. Uh, Ring of Chaos: A sudden shocking blast stuns surrounding enemies within three meters, dealing damage. Gear uh, master, take great care of your gear. Pays off. Increase armor by thirty percent. I assume that this would not need to be on my bar down here. I assume that this would just be like a passive. Uh, flaming attacks. Conjure the fire of Hephaestus. For 15 seconds, uh, you inflict fire damage. Uh, enemies can start burning. I would assume if you're not careful, they could catch you on fire. Passives don't have to go on the bar. Okay. Critical assassination. Hold F to critically assassinate. Uh, doing 200% assassin damage. Must be in range and have combat to perform it. So probably lets you one-shot higher level enemies. Hero Strike, single strike attacking, unleashing the full power of the Spear of Nidus, inflicts 60% assassin damage, can be used in active combat. Uh, summon a lieutenant to distract enemies for 30 seconds. It just says distract. I assume that they actually try to... Uh... Yeah, it seems like they try to fight with you, which seems pretty great. All right, so as a you know pet class enjoyer, uh, Beastmaster and Called Arms both seem like fun to me. Um, passives seem nice. Flaming attack seems like a an option against venomous attacks. Uh, it's just a, another way of buffing your weapon for a time, and I've already got one. Um, critical assassination seems like it would be really good. So I think I'm gonna get this for now, and then probably Called Arms of the Wolf thing later. Okay, what was the quest right over there? Um, snake in the grass. Okay, uh, actually we're right by like a, um, uh, God, I'm sorry, I can't remember the proper name for it. I'm gonna say waypoint, that, that thing. We're right by that thing. Sync point, sure. Yeah, the synchronized spot. There we go. Uh, question. If you tame a wolf and you finish a fight and the wolf's injured, does it recover health or does it stay injured? Covers. What are you okay. doing here? This is sacred ground. Oh my god. You should not be here. Well, either leave or tell me what you want. Who are you? I'm Istheos. I'm not here to start trouble, but if that's what you want, I'll end it. Your name? I'm Cassandra. Some called me the Eagle Bearer. I am Daphne, leader of the Daughters of Artemis. And you are maybe exactly who I've been looking for. Oh. And who would that be? A warrior, a hunter, one who straddles our world and the gods, one who will meet my challenge. When you put it like that, how could I not accept? Let's have more, <laughs> not too far from here. Kill it, then bring me its pelt. You want me to kill a pig? This is no ordinary boar. Let's see if you are worthy of my challenge. Kill it. And bring me the pelt. I'll be waiting with your reward. I um, I actually saw a, a a meme today, and it was a picture of, the, of some tweet from some guy. And the guy uh, posted a picture of someone uh, standing next to a boar that they had 
hunted, presumably, because the boar was just laying there, and they were standing next to it. And the boar was, like, the size of a small Volkswagen. Like, it was huge. And the tweet read, like, I owe an apology to all of the uh, people who I learned about in social studies class that died on boar hunts. I thought they got killed by some stupid small pig. I had no idea how big these things got. <laughs> He's like, I had no idea. <laughs> so, seeing this quest, just I'm like, oh, wait, man, I just saw a picture of a boar the size of a car just a few hours ago. How big is this one going to be? Uh, it's like small bear size, and they have tusks. Wonderful. Uh, Alright, let's see. Hipparchos the Spoiled. What is this? Is this just a mercenary? Um, hmm. He's only one level higher than me. So in... Uh, Valhalla? Well, the, the people that I would hunt on the map were like Templars, right? These guys... I don't have any any indicator that these are Templars. These are, these are just like people that come after me when I have a bounty. But I am rewarded for taking them out. <laughs> Yo, it wasn't me. Give me a break! It's my turn! Oh, I couldn't land the poison in time. Ah, oh, missed the fairy timing. Yeah, but I'm getting there. Oh man, the delay on that. This guy's giving me a lot of parry practice. Another marker knocked off the map. Might have been better there if I had swapped the take his shield away thing, but uh, it was working, so I didn't want to pause the game and mess with my, my stuff. If I can even change my skills in combat, I haven't actually tested if I can do that or not. Uh, let's see. What's next? Hmm, that's one level above me. You did last night, I think, didn't I? Not sure. Uh, do I have any more level 10 quests? Bounty on merchant ships, Spartan heads. If I do this, where is it? Does it mark them? Hmm. I guess let's just, let's go, let's explore just a nearby thing. Just keep going to the nearest thing. I kind of enjoy this map system. It reminds me of Guild Wars 2, where, you know, if you want to make progress, you can just open up the map and go to the nearest way unmarked waypoint or the nearest point of interest or the nearest 
you know, uh, quest marker, whatever, and just slowly get that sense of completion as you check things off on the map. It's like, as long as you're enjoying the gameplay, I think it's a great system. Yeah, it, it, it's not perfect for every game, because sometimes it's nice to just find hidden things, and, you know, if they're just marked on the map, you never have that, uh, that sense of accomplishment. But, you know, that, that right now I'm enjoying it. They'll be on high alert here. Huh? What do you think you are doing? Sorry, it was a prank. I'm gonna back up for a minute. He just did a split when she died. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, for oh, he lived. I uh, jump scared myself there. I thought he was dead and I turned around and he was not. I can't thank you enough. Uh, question. Your assassination damage. I've noticed that all the skills in assassination scale with your assassination damage. And I can see that when I open my inventory and I look at the character sheet. How do I raise that number? I assume it goes up when I level, but beyond that, is there anything I can do to raise that damage? complete. Okay, that was pretty simple. Like, like, when I equipped a better staff, did that also raise my assassination damage? Uh, is that the boar? That's level 13. Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. Battleground of Fukis. Lower the nation power. Oh, I still gotta lower the nation power some more. Hmm. Alright, let's check that one. There are equi There's equipment that can increase hunter, warrior, or assassin gear. Gear engravings. There's assassination hunter and or warrior damage boost. And when you... When you're just auto attacking like when i'm in combat and i'm just clicking the left mouse button to swing the stick does that i would assume that that's either a warrior or it's none of the above could you tell me which uh, which it is that's considered warrior damage okay um odyssey parry much more forgivable than lies of p oh yeah the parry in this definitely is just like you right click and you hold your weapon up and then if they hit you within like the next second and a half it's a parry it's a very large window. But sometimes I can't interrupt my current action by going into a parry, so... I definitely have to, like, think ahead one second in time and be like, can I commit to another swing? Can I commit to another swing? I've never seen so many olive trees. Assassination damage is when you use the spear, hunter, as bow. Right, that I've gathered. Yeah. Get out of the road! Prometheus and the birth of humankind. Wait, what? Kill Spartan state leaders. All right, hang on.
You're supposed to die from that. 